Venetians know that they need to brace themselves for flooding at this time of year. These weeks in autumn, known for those big tides that sometimes rise out of the canals and flood across the uh, piazzas and down the alleyways. But what we saw yesterday was really something quite exceptional. The sixth worst flooding for about 150 years since modern record-keeping began. About 70% of historic Venice underwater at one time with the dramatic effects that I think you can see for both tourists and uh, residents alike. A, a combination of we weather events, a strong southerly wind coming up the Adriatic and shoving a great mass of water into Venice Lagoon. At the same time, heavy rain across northern Italy, which has caused disruption in Tuscany and elsewhere, uh, flooding the lagoon via the rivers uh, as well. Most Venetians actually don't live on the ground floor of their properties. They leave that over to storage areas and, and so on. But businesses do have to operate on the ground floor, restaurants, shops, offices uh, and so on. It's often them that are worst hit in these affairs. They get a few hours to try to scramble to get stock and fridges and furniture and so on upstairs. But afterwards there's damage and a, a great mess as you can imagine. This corroding seawater uh, affecting walls and doors and windows. A huge disruption both in private lives and economic lives for this extraordinary city.